Louise. It's Louise here from Crazy Borgies. I thought I would do just a little stitch along with yourselves. This is my uh, Christmas themed stitch along that I've chosen. I can see I've got a bit of a shadow. Okay, the lighting is really bad in my room at the moment. So in my living room. So I do apologise. But this is... Hang on a second. I've got the... This one was gifted to me by Biggest Craft. It's an 11 count Ada cloth. And it is a 35 by 50. That's the image there. And it was $7.99 on the website. So I just wanted to hop on because I haven't done a... I feel like I haven't done a stitch along for ages with you guys. Okay, so this one just has 22 colours, not too many. And I was just working on some of the block colouring uh, or colour blocking even areas. So I'm just working on the sky at the back of Santa. So up here and then I'm just going to work down, do all the pink symbol, this bright pink. Um, and then work on to the more confetti-ish sort of areas. Don't know if I, I don't think I'll get this done for Christmas, but I wanted to make a start on it anyway and do something festive. So this is going to be like a Christmas tree with some snow on here in this corner. And that's obviously Santa. It's difficult to tell, isn't it, with the stamp kit sometimes. So I'm just going to do a little bit of a stitch along with yourselves. I can see that the picture quality isn't great here, so... I do apologise for that in advance. Okay. So if you are new to my channel, then please consider liking, subscribing, sharing, commenting down below, following me on TikTok and Instagram, on Crazy Borgies Diamond Art. And hitting the little notification button, which will notify you, or, or notification bell even, which will notify you of my future video uploads. Okay, let's get stitching. Hi guys, um, just to let you know that one of my children was talking to me at this moment in time. That's why there's silence on this little section. Um, but as you can see, I'm just working my way down the Ada cloth, um, doing half a stitch at a time, which is how I'm tackling the colour blocking area. And most of the time, this is how I stitch for comfort, to be honest with you. And then I work my way back up to make it a full stitch. Um, this is my preferred way of stitching and it's it's the one that I stitch the most to be honest with you um, I just find it really comfortable really relaxing and uh, it can be very therapeutic also okay I always like to wear a shorter nail length when cross stitching because when cross stitching I find if my nails are too long that it can really slow me down with the cross stitching um, especially when stitching like this doing two stitches at a time and yeah that's why I think I chose a shorter nail length just so that um, Stitching would be a bit easier for me. Once again, I do apologise for Rio squawking in the background. She's very grumpy at the moment and wants me to let her out for a little fly around and snuggle time. So I think I'm going to have to do that soon. Right, I've got a new piece of flossy because I've ran out, so let's start once more trying to stitch. So I chose this one just purely because I fancied doing something with Santa in, obviously. 
because he is going to be coming down the chimney soon. So this one has some little uh, forest friends in it as well. I think it's got a deer and a squirrel. Yeah, we don't have a chimney, so he'd be coming through the door. The door. Yes. So he, will he will shrink and go through the letterbox. Just like once when I watched that video, um, he just shrinks. Yeah. 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 Whoops. Well, stitching isn't the best tonight, guys. Let's see. Never mind. So, I hope you've been enjoying my uh, unboxing videos. I've had quite a lot recently. And can you believe it? I've still got quite a lot to come as well. So, yeah, I kind of got a bit, um, what's the word, behind with some of them. Hence why I was doing, uploading like two, two videos on the days that... On it every other day basically because that's when I like to upload some videos for you guys is every other day as you can hear Rio is in top form blowing me kisses so this one is Quite a biggish uh, cross stitch. Well, it is a big one. Really. Do you like my nails, guys? They're uh, quite pretty, aren't they? Just fancied like putting some nails on tonight. Oh, I've actually also got some footage of a garden centre. I went to earlier so um, you can see the snowy fields as well it was really festive actually Rio come on Shh. honestly I'm sure she's trying to pretend to be a crow in that cage you know as soon as I start filming she starts and the thing is is she was really quiet before yes i love you too rio i was really she was really quiet almost asleep so i thought oh okay i can film a bit now no as soon as i press record she starts doesn't she she's on my case So, it's really annoying actually, guys. I'm not going to lie. It's really annoying. Okay. Whoops. No, I went through the wrong section there. there. So I went to see my youngest perform in her little nativity play 
which was very cute, very cute. She was Angel Gabriel. Very important, very important part. And she done fabulous. She's a natural born entertainer anyway. You say it, darling. I can't really say what you, you said. She wants to say something now. Go on, darling. And uh, I was jumping around, skipping. Plus, I wasn't even crashing while spinning. Yes, she was multitasking very well. She was singing, she skipping, was skipping and spinning. And spinning. Without crashing. <laughs> All at the same time. And I, it made me feel dizzy just looking at her. I was like, whoa. Yes, because you were leading all the angels, weren't you? Were they angels you were leading or stars? Angels. Yes. So, she looked absolutely fabulous. Well, that's okay. That just means they're proper wings, doesn't it? Because even birds lose their um, <clears throat> feathers as well, don't they? Yes. So I have also got another on on unboxing video coming from Biggest Craft actually. It should be well it'll be on its way to me. So that should be arriving any day. And I'm trying to think who else. I think I've got diamond art gift as well to do and i've got a new to me company guys so um a company i've never heard of before has actually contacted me um they're they're not a budget friendly company either they are actually sort of like middle range so i wanted to give them a try to see the quality of the canvas etc the quality of the drills the diamonds um so yeah that's actually sitting on my sofa i only just received it this afternoon so it will be being filmed soon so watch out for that i can't remember what the company's name is i think it's top diamond art or something like that but when i film it i will put a new to me company because i haven't you know i kind of have always dealt with the same uh, companies even when I before I started my my YouTube channel right at the very beginning I I've always loved fan sales they've always been my number one to go to um, but I didn't really know much about the other companies until I started my own YouTube channel and then I was like oh you know, um, it's 
bird is driving me insane, guys. Thing is, if I get her out while cross-stitching, I know exactly what she's going to do. She's going to dive on the Ada cloth. And she is going to be trying to undo my stitches for me. Honestly, she sounds like she's in agony, doesn't she? Yeah, it was a really nice festive drive up there. A little bit disappointing with the uh, what was in the garden centre. Usually they do some really nice decorations and they're, they're a little bit on, on the expensive side, but they seem to have a lot of selection. So I like to go every year. And also, it was my uncle who died in May. It was one of his favourite shopping centres, actually. So, I thought to myself, well, I'd like to go, really, in memory of him. Because I did go there with, I did go there with him once. Because he used to like going there to have um, a walk around and cups of coffee and hot chocolate he used to like. I remember one time I went there with my children as well and he was a bit like, oh my gosh. Because <laughs> they were all over the place and it's a bit of a, an upper market garden centre. So it's, uh, you know, there's people that shop there. How can I put this? They don't have to worry much about money, if if you know what I mean. Um, so yeah, it, it's one of those garden centres and, uh, so you have to have your kids on, on your best behaviour really, or, or else you get glared at. Only today I had my child who had special needs with me and... She smashed a ball ball, didn't she? Yeah, she did. But, you know, I just thought, well, you know, they're, they're going to have to expect that when people bring children because even though I was telling her no touching, no touching, she didn't really quite grasp it, you know. To her everything she can touch and I tried to when you try to uh, confine her not confine her but you know when you try to restrict her movements from touching things it seems to make her hundred times worse so when that happened I was just like you know what that's the end of us looking around and I bought a couple of ornaments, just three or four. And it came to £10 for just three or four different ornaments. And I was like, whoa, okay. But they're cute. But if I'm honest with you, I said to my daughter, my eldest daughter, because we went there originally looking for ornaments for her tree because... Well, basically, remember how I said that some of the Christmas ornaments were on the floor of the shed and the bicycles in the summer had been ridden over them? Yeah, well, the ornaments were actually mostly her ornaments. And so they'd been all been smashed, down. yes. It's, like face. Yeah, he he'd smashed... Dad. Well, I don't know if he saw him or not, really. It's, that's highly debatable. But, um, <laughs> yeah. Oh, hang on a second, guys. My needle 
or my floss even has kind of gone in a bit of a twizz here. I'm just going to pause you one second, guys. Hang on. Okay, I am back and I have sorted out my needle. I'm not quite sure what happened there, but let's go again and try and get some of this pink background done. Go. So I think where am I gonna go next? I just might as well go down here still. The needle and the floss are putting up a fight with me tonight, guys, I'll tell you. So, last time I checked, I was on 920-something subscribers. And I'm just like, yay, I could not believe it. Really can't, guys. You know, I'm just over the moon literally about it so we're all learning from each other that's how i like to think of the crafting community and not just diamond painting community but cross stitch crochet knitting whatever you feel that you want to try we're all learning so and it's such a good platform to be able to to show each other what we're making what projects we're working on what our styles are what we like what we don't like etc i just think it it really is like a whole whole different world isn't it and I am so, so grateful that I found it because, honestly, like diamond painting, cross stitch, all of it has really helped me at some of my most lowest points. And everyone watching this video... You're in the shadow, yeah. darling. And everyone... That, it, Watching this video, Candy, please pray to our dog because we really do miss her. Oh, yeah, we do, don't we? We really miss Pring. My little Pringling. It was my birthday present. Yeah. Anyway, guys, I'm going to insert some of the footage now of the drive um <coughs> to the garden center i do do excuse the background noise um okay when filming in the evening yeah that's what happens but i just wanted to hop on and do as i said a little stitch along i'm gonna try and do um A longer one possibly as well when I get the time because the uh, you know time is just flying by guys at the moment it just goes way too fast way too fast so adios from me and I will speak to you all soon and I hope you've enjoyed this little quick very quick stitch along so i'm slowly working away across away over over here 
and then I'm going to try and get all this pink shading done and then I'll probably work on these these patches here and then I'll probably work on the blue the blue symbol as well so but yeah you know this will be one that will probably take me all year to do to be honest with you but I don't mind I'm not in a rush you know I think the worst thing you can do when you've got a hobby is rush things anyway so anyway I hope you've all enjoyed this little quick short stitch along I know it's not much really but I just wanted to hop on show you some of the footage that we recorded and say a quick hello okay so if you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed then please consider doing so and following me on tiktok and instagram on crazy borgies diamond arts and also if you could just give me a thumbs up that would be much appreciated because in the world of YouTube, that helps my video get advertised more on the algorithm, is it? Or whatever it's called. It's basically like you're giving a recommendation for someone else to watch. Um, and the more likes I get, then the more my video will be um, advertised out there, really. So... Um, bird i tell you she drives me insane guys i love her to bits though she is she is a lovely bird but she's just so noisy oh yes you agree don't you you are noisy yeah there we go so um lots of new exciting projects to come um for christmas for the new year as well and um hopefully we will hit 1000 subscribers soon i've still got to do my monthly giveaway that i'm going to do also i've got a really really exciting giveaway coming up from one day saving so just keep your eyes peeled for my unboxing video from one day saving guys because it's gonna be one that you really don't want to miss trust me Okay, because I'm going to be doing a giveaway as well. And not just one giveaway, but five, five giveaways, guys. All courtesy of One Day Saving. So you have to wait for my unboxing video, which is going to come, because I have got that package sitting there waiting for me to do as well. So it should come in a couple of days, the unboxing video. And I will put all the details of the giveaway in that video also, okay? And the rules are just that you have to be a subscriber to my channel to qualify for the giveaway, okay? And you have to subscribe to One Day Saving as well on their, uh, on their website. And then they can send you weekly updates of... Uh, their new products and their special offers and all that good stuff okay guys i'm gonna sign off because my eyes are now stinging like mad and uh i need to go and get the kids to bed or get one of them to bed at least take care god bless and i will speak to you all soon okay guys so bye for now and look after yourselves most importantly look after your loved ones and your fur babies and your pets and elderly people as well and make sure to pray to our dog <laughs> take care god bless and we will speak to you soon bye for now bye, bye. Press, uh, snowy up here